remember that day. It was, it was a pretty embarrassing day. Well, I got fired from being a substitute teacher. And that day, I was ashamed. How could I, how could I get fired from being a sub? But I was going to class late. You know, I was playing games on the computer. I was doing things like that. You know, just slacking off and not doing my best at my job. But I didn't really like the job anyway. I decided that day that something was gonna happen. I was gonna make it happen. I didn't know how, but something was gonna come for me. And two days later, I got an offer to go to Puerto Rico and make $200 a day being a translator for a restoration company. It was scary because I didn't know the people I was gonna travel with. I didn't know who I was gonna go with. I didn't know we're gonna travel in a private plane and arrive in Puerto Rico. It's pretty dangerous there. They don't have traffic lights. And this was right after the hurricane. But you know what? Without risk, there is no reward. So I got on that plane. I got to Puerto Rico. I made my money. After 10 days, they gave me a job. I worked with them for a month and a half. Everything else is history. After that, I went to Italy. I went through Dominican Republic, Germany. Then I went to Belgium and Ireland. I touched El Vatican and San Marino. And I had the most beautiful experience in Italy. The first time I've ever been to a country that I didn't speak the language. And let me tell you, it wasn't easy always, but it was truly an experience I will never forget. Once I got back home, I celebrated Christmas with my family. And now I can talk about this whole thing right here.